Strasburg, you know, tough starting off and just to get the offense rolling came a little, a little bit later on, but yeah, a little a little late and couldn't get a whole lot going. It's kind of the theme of the series in general. Obviously, I think we've you know competitive at bats again today. Just ne never really get anything going. Um, we just pitch count up pretty decent early in the game, where you know guys are. You know, it's not just one, you know, 10 pitch innings or anything like that. So I think that part was good from the standpoint of, of the battle. Uh, we just didn't really break through. When overall, just the weekend when you start and, you know, the guys had good approaches against Scherzer sure, and you know, then kind of the rest of the time, just, I guess, what did you see out of the lineup overall? No, uh, we, we didn't really have success. I mean, that's what I think what, what we saw. But uh, again, we faced three guys this series that are. You know, a pretty good, pretty good little matchup for us, and a pretty good measuring stick. You know, kind of where we're at, and obviously we weren't able to put up a lot of runs uh, this series. Uh, threw the ball pretty good for the most part, and um, you know, just weren't able to kind of break through where we could get four or five in there and, and put more pressure on them. And now the yes, or what you think? I mean, first three innings was pretty sharp, and then I mean, a couple no, of races. Yeah, pretty good. Um, yeah, really, really sharp early. Uh, I thought there in the fourth. Is seemed like he got behind in a lot of counts. You know, we've seen, you know, 3 0. I think, I think that's the inning. The Harper just misses one. Uh, then he gets 3 0 on Rendon, or 3 1 is when he popped him. Uh, he's behind on uh, Adams and just missed him. So, you know, I think that's one of the things that, that's been impressive is he's been able to stay ahead in the count, at least even where the guy has some doubt what's coming. Uh, He's, he's fairly he's going to come after you, and I'm sure they're seeing that when uh, if he's behind an account. Um, but in general, still bounces back from that. He didn't really – you don't see him just getting beat up. He keeps coming, keeps throwing strikes, keeps making you earn what you get. And uh, that's what we, you know, we've liked about him. When you see the offense not scoring, does that change the way that you, you manage trying to go station to station, maybe manufacture runs through the running game and stuff like that? Well, it's hard to manufacture when you're not on. That's, that's the biggest thing. I, I think we do want to try to put the game in motion and give ourselves some chances to open up some holes. Uh, but, it, you know, I think I look out there late and we got three hits, so we didn't nearly have a whole lot of chance uh, to do it today. But it's one of the things you'd like to be able to do. Um, with Harlan right now, I mean, it's kind of a tough spot. I haven't pitched much in the last two weeks, but I guess what have you seen just you know, the way that he's... Uh, I, I think I, I you know obviously I can't go in and look at video you know, during the game or this quickly after, but look like the the fastball to Harper. He's probably trying to go away and it leaks it back over in, into his zone, um, you know. And then we have to kind of go from there to see where he's getting on on guys because I thought he made some good pitches today. Uh, Defo, we, you see him change speeds, change speeds, change speeds, and then elevate. Um, so again, I think we have to look at it and and let Juan kind of. You know, talk about what he sees and then talk about him going forward. Don, that's 11 in a row now against the Nationals. It's just a matter of a team getting into another team's head. It's to get out of a situation uh, like that. That usually doesn't happen when you don't have a pretty good club doing that right to you. Um, so they're, they're a talented club, so you're going to have to fight for your wins all the time. Uh, and then, you know, I didn't really know it was uh, 11. Uh, I know we had our struggles last year late with them. I thought we were pretty good early with them, played them pretty even. Uh, and then later in the year, they got us. Uh, but obviously, they got a, a club that, you know, even with some guys out, and, you know, they got some pieces missing. But that starting rotation has really been there, you know, pretty steady. You know, you're going to get those three, you get Geo. You get, I mean, every time you get those guys, uh, you're going to get somebody that's got good stuff and it's going to give you you're going to be in a game. So, uh, again, I don't think necessarily in our head, you know, part of our guys probably never faced them. So, um, just they got a good club. Strasburg's just been a menace, kind of, too. So he's, he's a... He's scoreless in, so I think now for... He, he's got good stuff. I mean, again, I, I think we've talked about it every day. It's been a different challenge. You know, Max is a challenge. Uh, Rourke's a, a challenge in a different way. Uh, you get to Strasburg, and it's another challenge of, of a guy with, you know, pure stuff, with a curveball, with the change, with the slider. Uh, so, he, and he, you know, he has some weapons. Obviously, he hasn't been as, as good as he's been without being able to get the ball to both sides of the plate. Has weapons for pretty much everybody. So, um, he's a handful, you know. And, again, it, our starting pitches, 
pitching has kept us in these games, given us chances to win. We just haven't been able to break through and get the runs we need.